welcome to Char Guard, and I hope you're doing okay at the moment. We're going to open up some of these brand new shiny... V I wasn't called shiny V then. <laughs> but the shiny Fates tin sets. Of course, if you love our channel and you want to show some support, smash that like button and give us a comment if you've managed to get hold of any of these shining Fates, or if you've pulled anything really, really cool that you need to brag about. So we're going to open up these new tins. Now in the UK, we are used to seeing the this size. Now we normally get four TCG packs in here, but the reason why these are that little bit more dearer than these sort of tins, because these retail at like $21.99. These are $26.99 RRP, and I got these from a local card shop. I was so happy to manage to get one of each design. I can't believe it. Just don't, don't go on eBay and pay the, over the odds. These are going for over £50 each at the moment, and the next wave is due was it uh, second or third week of March, they're saying, so far, retail stores. So just wait until then. Just save your money. Buy two lots then for the same price as one. There you go. Money-saving tip there from Chara Card. So, of course, in these, we do get a promo card. Boop, boop. And we get five TCG packs of Shining Fates. And, of course, we get the online trading card game code as well. Um, uh, by the way, I'm loving Pokemon doing this new way of, instead of wrapping the whole product, they're doing, like, a band instead. Um, and also doing the tear mark. It's quite an easy way to uh, duplicate. I mean, I'm not too sure. I'm not in the packaging department. But what would be better of Pokemon? Just, just do a little void tape around here that sticks to it. As soon as you break it, you can't remove that void tape. That'd be much better. Shall we see what we get in the Elder Goss V? Oh, okay. Now, I've been looking forward to opening up these. Oh, wow. Ooh, look at there. I thought there was going to be cardboard in here. So, of course, we get the five packs. Oh, we've got two Charizards, one Corviknight, and two Dragapults. Oh, no toxicity there. Of course, we get the... Oh, I might as well show you that these are much better now. These are much better than the old ones when you used to have, uh, have to bend your promo cards. Oh, I can't get this out. Look. There we go. Well, there's a co-card there for you all. And oh, I'll show this camera just in case. Boop. And here's the Elder Goss shiny promo card, which, yeah, is really nice looking. Very nice. Looking forward to getting a set. What I am going to do to make things a little bit neater, I'm just going to set the tin in the back. And whatever we pull, we're going to put in front of the pack. There we go. So instead of put, calling all the names on these, I'm just going to open these up. Otherwise, it's going to be a very long video. Open up 15 packs of Pokemon cards. And let's see what we get. So, of course, Shining Fates, absolutely amazing. It's a fun set to pull. Um, I'm loving it, and I hope you lot are loving it too. And, yeah, I've seen some people pull some absolute bangers out of this set. And uh, I hope to get a few more because I started to do my binder. And it's looking like Swiss cheese at the moment. So I've got more Pico, a Cactus, a Flutzel, and a Ducidii. Not too bad for the first one. Ducidii Holo. Very nice indeed. So the next pack. Um, I'm feeling a little bit sorry for Hidden Fates, really. I mean, I've seen Hidden Fates products come back. I've seen the tins back here in the UK. Um... There's some reasonable price ones. I mean, some of the retailers. Uh, where I get most of my stuff has managed to secure some Hidden Fates tins. And they're selling for RRP. I mean, talk about amazing us. So, so um, of course, I've got some Hidden Fates. I've just bought two tins for now. I don't want too many. A reverse Nicket and a Thievil. Hollow, look at that. I'm loving the Thievil on this one. <laughs> it's more like a kangaroo. It's kangaroo. <laughs> So the Hidden Fates, I mean, poor Hidden Fates. I do feel sorry for them. So we'll show you some Hidden Fate co-cards that I've had stored around. So here we go. Some co-cards for you all out there. Yeah, I may as well. I mean, Hidden Fates have been completely and utterly <laughs> undershadowed by the new Shining Fates. There we go. It's the last one there. Hopefully that, uh, you know, you managed to pull some good cards online there. Just let us know if you pull anything decent. Let's open up a Corviknight. Let's see how we get on with this one. Boop. Of course, yeah, we're enjoying doing all these um, product openings. I mean, I left the poll on the other day for what you would like to see on the channel more. And, um, of course, the, ma uh, the majority of you like to see product openings, which I don't blame you. I like looking at product openings here in the UK. And right? oh, look at that! Out of a Corviknight, a shiny Corvusquire, and a Yamega. Look at that. That's a gorgeous-looking card. The shining cards are absolutely amazing, this set. However, with 122 to get... 
I think this is going to be a very hard set to complete. And um, to be honest, I don't think I'd be, I'm going to go a bit hard and tail like I did a Rebel Clash in Champion's Path. I'm close to my Darkness Ablaze binder. I'm very, very close now. Looking forward to completing that. Of course, there's quite a few cards in this set I want to get hold of. I mean, I'm looking forward to the amazing rares. I'm a collector of those amazing rares. And uh, I'm going to send some off to Graydon Gems when they're a little bit, not as busy, because they're really busy at the moment. And uh, I'm going to see if I can get some amazing rares done and see how they turn out. Oh, look, amazing rares. That's our third Rashiram. If anyone's got any Kyogres or Yoverto, do you want to swap a Rashiram up for it? <laughs> Absolutely amazing. And, you know, let's not, let's not give in to the Malathy. Malathy is a lovely, lovely Pokemon. Last pack magic out of the Elder Goss. Let's see how we get on. So, of course, like I said, after the Amazing Rares, I'm going to talk about Amazing Rares again, just in case I pull another one, because I want to get them graded, and I want the set along my mantelpiece, because it looks absolutely amazing. So, let's hope for a shiny Pokemon again. So, there's a Light Energy, Tropolis, Rotom, Rusted Shield, a Yanmar, a Coffin, a Morpico, a Horsey, a Green Spider, a Shinx, and a Dreadnought. Very, very nice. Just wish this was a hollow version, because that would be much nicer, to be honest. So, what do we go into next, then? Do we do the Cramorant or do we do the Boltond? Now, personally, me, I prefer the Cramorant, so I'm going to leave that one till last. Let's break in to Boltond. I'm loving the way this peels. <laughs> I mean, you can't see it on camera, but it's absolutely amazing. Of course, the Boltond, same sort of uh, packaging, of course, comes with the... Uh, lovely, lovely, lovely looking promo card. Absolutely gorgeous. And of course, here's the code card for you over there. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. I love these cards. Sleeve these up, and these will be amazing in the future. I guarantee they're going to be a lovely, lovely collector's item in the future. Um, obviously, I, I, I love to collect cards. I'm I'm terrible. I've got a binder here. I mean, if you all want to see me do a video of my binder of doubles, I'm more than happy to show it. Um, there are so many doubles, and I'm, I, I can't part with some of my cards. There's so many lovely cards I just love looking at, and I get excited looking at the cards. Um, obviously, I used to collect the Pokemon cards back when it first started, when I was a wee little lad. Uh, when it first came out here in the UK, I remember. I remember holding some of the base set. I had a Blastoise Hollow as well back then. Gave it away. Would you believe? Gave it away for free. <laughs> I think it was uh, for a um, Sega Dreamcast game back then. In DD. And another D Dreadnought. No, go away, Dreadnought. Don't want you. But the reverse MDD is very nice for the set. But of course, like I said, I've been collecting them for a while. But I've just got back into collecting Pokemon. And I'm absolutely loving it. I think I, I think if you've all started Pokemon, like myself, you know, last uh, mid last year, late last year, this is the best time to start now. Because so many cool cards are coming out at the moment. And so many of these modern sets, like the Battle Styles, hitting next month. Oh, I don't know. We've got, we've got the new um, uh, Crown of Tons and stuff. <gasps> Shiny Centre Scorch. Very, very nice. Look at that. And of course, a Volcanic Odd. But look at that. <gasps> I love playing Centre Scorch. I'm a, I'm a terrible Centre Scorch fan on um, online TCG. I mean, you can check me out. I'm Characard YT on uh, the online one. Um, I, I was very impressed. I had a 12 win streak the other day. Absolutely happy with it. Could not believe my luck. Um, of course, it's quite a quite a very powerful card, Centre Scorch, if played correctly with Weld or a few of the other ones. But yeah, I won't bore you because not, all of you, not a, lot, a lot of you out there like to listen to the um, online TCG. But do you know what? I love it. It's a lot of fun. So, of course, uh, we've got the Crown Tundra style cards coming out of all the uh, new... Um, Legendary Pokemon, which I'm looking forward to because Articuno is my favourite Pokemon. And just recently, I have been purchasing. Oh, Indy the Hollow, very nice. That's a very heavy card. That that's really, really heavy. Um, yeah, Articuno is my favourite Pokemon because people think, is it Magikarp? Because you know, I've got Magikarp here, me hugging on it. No, Magikarp is a bit of a fun card. I've always enjoyed Magikarp, and I love Gyarados. But my number one Pokemon out there has always been Articuno. Um, just. Just because it was my first ever legendary, I caught with a Master Ball back in the uh, Pokemon Blue back in the day. And uh, I've just loved it ever since. So uh, I continued the trend and try and keep hold of uh, some of my Articuno cards. So, of course, we're still after the. Shiny. Oh, look at Grim Snow Shine of oh, Shining V and a Zaru. <laughs> oh, look at the Grim Snow. You know, he looks like he's having a bit of a bad day, doesn't he? Wow, look at that. It's a lovely looking card, though. 
So that's nearly all the V cards. We've got the Ditto. We've got all sorts now with the Vs, but we still haven't got one V Max. Very disappointed. Come on, Toxtricity. Let's get something here. So what's your, your favourite Pokemon? What's your number one Pokemon that you think? Oh, I love that. Oh, I love the artwork on that. What is yours? Leave it in the comments what you enjoy. And at the same time, leave in the comment. Just smash that like button as well. Give this pack some luck. So Metal Energy, a Thraki, a Cramorant, a Rusted Shield, Snoom, a Trap Pinch, a Nickit, a Beazle, Shinx, Reverse Gossy Flare, and a Yamaha Scooter. <laughs> So, of course, two hits, two hits. This is an interesting ratio. Do you reckon we're going to get two hits of the Cramorant V? Let's go for it, everyone. Let's see how it goes. Oh, well, that was a lot easier getting that one, wasn't it? Boop. <laughs> I just love the Cramorant artwork. I absolutely love it. This is a fun card. Absolutely amazing looking. This, this is just fun all over. <laughs> Do you know what? If I was a Pokemon, I probably would be Cramorant V. I think I would be. <laughs> Of course, Boop. there we go. Not forgetting the code card for you lot out there. Do you guys want some more Hidden Fates codes? Well, here we go. Boop. <laughs> Give some more, because I've got loads of these Hidden Fates. I mean, I've got these from ages ago, these ones. So uh, it's nice to get rid of some of the code cards. People always ask, what do I do with the cards and what do I do with the code cards afterwards? Well, to be honest, the code cards, I like to give out. Uh, some of uh, Owen's friends like playing Pokemon. I like to give it to people. Um, and my bulk cards, I normally sell them as bulk online. Um, I just sell them because at the end of the day, I don't need to sit on too many cards. And you know, I sit on my doubles. I like some of my cards. And you know, it's, it's nice because when the Pokemon community get back together again, and uh, oh, there's some nasty whitening on this card. See that? Nasty. Um, we can do some trades again in Swapsies, which I'm looking forward to doing that again, because what's upside Have I done that wrong? Upside down, there we go. Nope, it's just me. <laughs> Thraki, Cramorant, Dartrix, Grookey, Trapinch, Yanmar, Coffin, Morpico, Thraki, and a Yang Mega Scooter. <laughs> I'm seeing a few of them at the moment, aren't I? Um, oh, look, one of each, everyone. This is a nice one, we get one of each. Let's go for it. Let's go for a Dragapult. So yeah, I'm looking forward to meet, doing all the meets and greets again, uh, trading all the cards. Uh, you know, it's, it's just good fun. Um, always poke. Oh, do you know, I, I shuffled it wrong. D oh, what keeps going wrong with this? Luxio, Gym Trainer, Team Yeltao, Cactus, Shudua, Green Spider, Keithan, Gossip Flare. Oh, look at him. Very, very nice and shiny Toxtricity. Wow. That's very nice, isn't it? I love, I'm loving, absolutely loving this artwork. Put it up here just in case I miss it on the edit, but that, they've done a great job on these shiny cards. I have to admit, top notch to you, uh, Pokemon. Well done for doing shiny fates. I mean, two years time? How about darken fates? Hey, eh? you know, have shadow Pokemon, have dark Pokemon. I mean, we've got the light stuff here, so why not have the opposite? So, Pokemon, if you do watch my videos, which I very much doubt you do, I don't blame you anyway. I'm just a silly old me that live here in the UK and just open up Pokemon cards for fun. What's going on with these water... What's, what's going on with these cards? Always upside down, the energies. Rusted Shield Sword, Gym Trainer, uh, Rowlet, Trap Inch, Boozle, Coffin, Shinx. Oh, isn't it shiny? There we go, look at me. It's like she's going to be sick. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice artwork. Oh, so have I just seen a little bit of a trick there? Is the energy ups you know, is upside down? Does that mean I get a shiny? Ooh. Come on. We've got two here now, so we can get nothing else now. I guarantee it. You watch. Of course, the pull rates on these items, you're not guaranteed to get anything every time. So, of course, um, I'm just happy to get anything. I, I was happy just for promos. Um, I mean... Look at India, that's cool. In look, look, if I don't... Oh, I sort of just saw something then. I don't think there's anything special, sorry, but I did see something at the back there. So the energy was upside down again, if you noticed. So uh, let's get to... More Pico. Yavel... Yavel... Yavel Tau? Yavel Tau? I pronounce it different to people. Yavel Tau. And a Crobat! Look at that! Very happy. I just need one more amazing rare, everybody. I just need my Kyogre. So, of course, Cramorant is completely washing the floor today. Bye-bye, Elder Goss, and bye-bye, Bolton. I mean, I was very happy with the V-card, actually. That's a really good card to get. 
Last Pack Magic, and thank you very much to everybody who watches these videos. I mean, we enjoy making these videos, and I'm glad you lot are enjoying it at the moment. Um, I've got, like I said, I've got some more Shining Fates shorts coming out, and we've got a few more items to be shown on the channel very soon. If you want us to... Are we going to get the fourth pack lucky? Come on, let's go for it. If you want us to put anything else on this channel, just leave a description. I mean, any content, sorry, not you know, the comments. Because at the end of the day, we just enjoy opening this up. But you know, sometimes you guys want to see something else. And of course, you guys enjoy watching us open up things. Just let us know you want us to open up. You know those really expensive vintage cards? Because they're so expensive, I can't afford those. Ball guy? Nope, it didn't work. Just my whole pack was upside down. But you know what? I'm happy with the ball guy. But thank you very much, everyone. And we'll see you very soon in the shorts. Take care, everyone. Bye.